Today we dine on turtle soup, starting with Rainforest. Reniferous. And I'm not sure why these uh, little 3D point approaching things aren't working properly and frame rates all being skippy and a jerk, but don't know why they're not working properly on my wife's computer, but it doesn't seem to be affecting the rest of the game, so I'm not terribly worried about it. It's just a few seconds of really skippy kind of kind of weird glitchiness, but like I say, I'm not that worried about it. We want to jump up in these treetops right here, right at the beginning. We want to avoid Mr. Mr. Bumpy Owlman. They're just kind of springs. They don't actually hurt you, but there's still something to be avoided for now, at least until we get rapid fire, which won't happen for a while. What we want to do is we want to jump off and grab ourselves a one-up. There we go. That's what I was going for right there. And we're going to want to get all the one-ups we can get, because the end of episode boss... Not going to talk too much about it right now, but it is a tough boss to deal with. It's kind of like the boss at the end of Episode 6, the Dark Jazz, that giant Dark Shadow Jazz clone. is kind of like that, in, in that if you lose to him, it's really hard to recover. He's kind of a tough jerk of a boss. It's very... And uh, I hope we won't have to deal with him more than once, but I don't want to get too worried about it right now. Right now, I just want to be building up items and such, and we do want to get up there, actually. Oh, there we go. There's that that Razor Owl. <laughs> Anytime I can take a chance to do that multiple times in a video, I totally will, and you know me. You know by now that I like the Razor Ouchie. Nothing off this way, but if we go this way, there's a Hip Hop, and there are tons of Hip Hops around here, actually, and especially in one particular part. This is a pretty safe spot to run through, I think. To an extent. No, pretty much the whole way through. Okay. So, let's see. This place has some pretty kicking music, too. That's a pretty... That's a pretty excited-sounding theme song right there. Up and away, and we're already halfway through. This is not a terribly long level. It does have one kind of really frustrating part, but... Where it's practically raining monkeys. Both levels have a segment like that. Monkeys are the only real threat around here. This is kind of a bland planet as far as enemy variety, actually. And there was another hip-hop right there, right immediately after the one we just got. More TNT that I'm probably never going to use. But hey, never say never, right? We don't actually want to go this way. We want to go back to where we were. We are going to get ourselves some invincibility. Let's get stocked up. Try to keep up, hip-hop. Try to keep up with jazz, you know? It's about the notes that aren't there. Can't believe it's taking me this long to make a jazz joke. Like, about actual literal jazz music this whole time. Although I probably have at some point. I, I, it's not like a faucet. I don't turn it on or off. It never turns off with me and the jokes and the glaven. -da -da -da. Let's try not to waste this, please, actually. Okay, yeah, that was pretty much effectively wasted, actually. And I didn't even get a chance to jump right there. Well, that wasn't too bad, but we're going to just run without shooting for now. We can run along this tall tree branch. We're going to find... Oh, no, those are actually monkeys. I thought they were hip-hops, because whenever I shot them, they made a <coughs> sound like I had uh, opened up a hip-hop cage. Obviously not the case. <laughs> I thought I was just opening up tons of hip-hop cages and test runs, and that this was, like, just some kind of hip-hop homeworld, weirdly enough. And it made sense at the time. Okay, you need to get off my back, monkeys. I missed a few items because of you. Contrary to what it looks like, you can actually brush up against these thistle walls. They're not spikes. Oh my god, I am not being careful. But it doesn't really matter because I'm at the end of the level anyway. Boom! 96% enemies and, yeah, no percent items despite the two hip-hops I saved and the one-up that I got and the whatever. This is a kind of frustrating segment, actually, for... The beginning of a level around here. <laughs> wow, two opportunities to do it in one... In one... There's some trinkets! I was starting to wonder. This is... Yeah, see, not much to collect around here. Not much in the way of enemies. And this is definitely a raining monkey tree. So, you kind of want to look up before you do anything risky. Like, you know, jump into makeshift Amazon spikes. That's cool. Just... And you got these bent branches that are very hard to jump precisely on. It's just... This is not a kind level. At least this segment is not. So we want to just charge through the exorcist head spinning white owls that really make no sense belonging. See? 
no matter how you jump, you got to be really careful about how you jump because there's just constantly monkeys. Yes, please, I will take that. I plan on wasting no time, even though there's probably something that will catch my attention. Yep, like this, that is just going to make it difficult for me to get up the tree. Yeah, you just go on and you do your thing. I don't really even care about you at this point. I just want out of this freaking tree. Okay, yeah. See, they're just coming from some magical monkey spawning nowhere hell shit. Uh, ba -ba. And now they're going to keep spawning and I'm probably going to die. But, well, I'm not too concerned about dying because it's not like I've lost any rapid fires or anything. This will help major. Okay. This is good. And I kind of had to lose that one to get across the ledge. That was kind of mean of them to put an enemy there, but... Oh, well. Them's the breaks, I guess. So, let's jump across here. Let's try to... Okay, nothing at the top of the tree. Nothing useful whatsoever. I could really use a carrot right now. I'm not really too keen on... I mean, I'm glad for Fire Shield, don't get me wrong, but... Yikes. I am doing pretty... Pretty horribly. Whoa! Cactus, cactus, cactus on either side of me. Pokey. Uh, uh, I don't think so. See, they just run around. And most of the monkeys around here are the ones, I think, that stay on ledges. Which makes it... Um... Yeah, we're just going to have to proceed with caution, I suppose. You know, like that. Man! <laughs> there are all kinds of opportunities to get... Okay, I feel a little ripped off, actually, now. Because I thought there would be something cool up here for being able to get up in this tree. But no... They don't feel like rewarding me. They're just like, you got up in a tree. Good job. Now here's nothing. Yes, thank you, game. So much for the big old fat nothing you gave me. That was actually probably kind of a stupid drop to make, actually. Okay. Oh, hey, hip-hop from the beginning of the level. Nice to get around to seeing you finally. And I think we're going to get an airboard right here. There we go. Maybe now we can find something reason I'm going back and doing a lot of backtracking is because there's a one-up up there that's impossible to get otherwise. We do have to do some uh, kind of minor backtracking now, and I should probably be more careful in case a monkey spawn. Oh, yeah, great. Now I have to squeeze through this little passage. Also, got to be super mega careful. It's kind of like Medivo, except a little bit tighter spacing. So... Okay, this is one of those times when I'm going to want to get, like, in the middle of the ledge and just round my way up. Yeah, okay. There we go. All right. Yes! About flipping time. Thank you. And I want to go up and get... No, we don't want to... There's more... There's more of that around here, I think. The rapid fire stuff. So I want to be... want to be ultra careful. Oh. You see something, boy? Okay, yeah, that'd be... Th okay, I thought that was just going to lead to awkwardness, but maybe not. Generally not ever the best idea to hit your airboard. Okay, good. They're the stay-on-the-ledge type. Actually, kind of a nice concession by the game there. I can't believe they did that. Okay. Uh, oh, yes. Fire shield refill. Daddy's going to be needing that. But not before he gets maxed out on rapid fire. Yes, please, and thank you. And I don't know why I'm going for these stars. That's probably a really stupid idea. Oh, nope. This is one of those times when the game actually did not let me keep that. Now, before we get all spring crazy, we want to just stay on this red one here. And, wow, I am hanging on by the skin of my teeth. That red bar has been flashing for quite a while. And it's just that the game has been nice enough to give me fire shields that, thankfully, aren't too badly spaced out. Um... We should be reaching the uh, bonus stage soon as well. Anything useful to be had by stepping on these things? I'm guessing no. Yeah, they're just kind of there for kicks and giggles. Yes, all the toasters I can get, and preferably also all the rapid fires and launchers. Hello, field of cactus. So you're basically going to make me jump blindly, aren't you? Well, why don't I just charge right in... Yeah, I'll lose a piece of fire shield. Sometimes you lose two pieces of fire shield there because you're just charging into a tree with monkeys in the top of it. Yeah, okay, yeah. We want to clear out as many of these monkeys as we can. Not only the monkeys, but also the exorcist owls because they can't actually be killed. It's only worth it to do so if you can just 
plow through with with gunfire. And I think we actually we might actually want to go back a little. Yeah, no, 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 no. See, if we sit here and just pump him full of bullets, he'll disappear eventually. Yeah, you can help out too, Hip Hop. If you want to feel important, then go for it. We want to make our way all the way over to the left here. I could have done this more easily earlier, but... There's our bonus gym. Okay, well, now I'm just... See, monkeys spawn everywhere. There's like at least, probably... 20 monkeys in this tree segment. Okay. Invincibility, I need you. And I'm not going to waste... Okay. I just said I'm not going to waste time, and then I got distracted by TNT. But we want to keep on the high road here, because if we stay on the low road, we're going to run into a bit of a dead end. And Okay, yeah, now I jumped too high, though. That's why you want to get rid of those spring owls. They can be a real distraction. But we should be good, and we should also, thankfully, be near the end of the level. I just realized, well, Hip Hop is here to save me. I can take one more hit, really. Okay. Yeah, I'll go up into the tops of the trees one more time. I am really, I'm really pushing this by the skin of my teeth. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get out of my face, kid. You bother me. Let's see. Yeah, we want to stay up in the tree. There we go. And then, yeah, now we're on the other side of this ledge, which would be pretty tough to get over if, uh, now we're just going to make a drop into Nowheresville. Is there a monkey anywhere around here? No monkeys, we're safe, good. Let's get out of here while we can with our bearings attack. Good lord, they were not very kind with the 45. Holy cow, okay. Oh, man. And exit signs all over your face. Ooh, yeah, now they're... Golly, now they're getting mean with it. And I only have two minutes to find what I think is the most number of gyms I've had to find yet. 45, holy crap. Okay, yeah, I actually got that, cool. Uh, yeah, okay, we don't need to be edging into, we don't have time to just be creeping up on these things. Maybe we should be jumping and jumping and jumping and jumping, and dead end, great. Whoa, I actually missed one, okay. Well, we're about halfway through. I don't think I'll need to find an hourglass, but I could get tripped up. <laughs> God 